A former manager at Columbia Sportswear has pleaded guilty to hacking into the company's computer system after leaving for another job. The U.S. Attorney's Office says he accessed the company's emails hundreds of times, essentially spying on his former employer. Our Jennifer Dowling is digging deeper. Michael Leeper headed up a portion of Columbia's IT department, so he knew the computer system inside and out. And prosecutors say he used that to his advantage. It's a really interesting uh, case of an insider threat. Ken Weston is a security analyst and researcher. He develops auditing systems to help companies look for red flags from former employees, and he's been following the Michael Leeper case closely. He had privileged access, so he created a, uh, a, a, a fake account uh, that had um, probably had escalated privileges that would allow him to have admin access to the email systems, financial systems, and everything on that network. Assistant U.S. Attorney Scott Bradford said Leeper created an account under a bogus name before leaving Columbia Sportswear in 2014. Leeper is accused of arming that account with powers typically reserved for managers. Bradford says the account allowed him to backdoor Columbia's network after taking a job with an IT company that provided services for Columbia. A lot of times organizations, when people leave, they don't necessarily audit those privileged users. Bradford added that Leeper was intercepting Columbia emails as they came through live and viewing sensitive financial information at his former company. His employer at the time, Denali Advanced Integration, issued a press release in March saying that Leeper was fired after an internal investigation. It's interesting as I've done a lot of research on insider threat um, you know, and uh, you know in that research they've actually found there's a lot of different um, reasons people will do these types of things. So the first is of course financial gain, right? So that sounds like what it's in this case, but it can also be sabotage um, if someone is um, unhappy with their workplace environment. Leeper faces up to 10 years in prison and a $250,000 fine. He'll be sentenced December 7th. Jennifer Dowling, Coin 6 News.